So it's spooky season once again at our house, and that actually means a lot of things. And before we get into it, oh, and we're going to get into it. You guys rush it with the comments. Crush it. There was like 1,700 comments last video, and I read 99% of them. I liked 99% of them. The only ones I didn't like were not nice. So please, please, if you have something you'd like me to read, leave a comment. I'm going to read it. And I'm actually going to pin my favorite comment 24 hours from now. Also, shout outs. Shouting out the new subs and the OG subs. Gonna be shouting out 10 new subs, 10 OG subs on the next video. So if you want a chance at a shout out, hit the button. And while you're there, give us a thumbs up. And lastly, I wanted to give you a quick update regarding Penny. She's fine. Don't worry. She's fine. She is getting older. However, her age is not the problem. It's her stubbornness. She has decided to go on a bit of a hunger strike. She refuses to eat any of her normal food. I've even tried every single brand of dog food you can think of. She won't do it. The only thing that she seems even remotely interested in is people food, which we never give her. But this is an issue because she needs to eat. So I did a little research and I actually think I found something. I went to this website called The Farmer's Dog. Blew my mind. They hand package your pet's food specific for your pet. And it's real food, human grade. And they deliver it right to your house. Soup's easy. And when I saw human grade, I was like, she loves human food. Let's do it. And of course, I'm going to test the theory. The things I do for you guys. It says Penny's turkey recipe. All right, human taste test. Not bad. Not bad. Anyways, check them out. Be sure to click the link in the description of this video to save 60% off your first purchase. Or just go to thefarmersdog.com. No, 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 no. So I know many of you have been asking for an update regarding the ghost situation. So I think that's the perfect place to start and maybe finish. Okay, quick update from our last video. We got our new TV. It's a, pretty much the exact same one just because the fit is like perfect there so i didn't want to go any bigger or smaller but yeah new tv also still have the bells for now since the last incident they haven't really been acting up but if anything happens during this video then i will be sure to document it for you also still have this totem or whatever it is you can see how it's charred from when it just spontaneously combusted it makes me nervous just to even touch it i don't want to get rid of it just yet because i have no idea if it's going to make things worse i need to do some research and figure out if it has any kind of meaning but for now i've been keeping it locked away i brought it out just to show you that we still have it that being said let me show you the new halloween decorations for the house Kristen went all out hey sleepy puppies you want to see the newly decorated house take that as a no okay well i'm gonna show everybody anyway starting off with the simple little details spider coaster holder Ooh, moving on to the fireplace creepy webbing all up the tv so Beetlejuice. Moving on to the window and the creepster rat covered in more spider webs. Hey guys, very authentic feel and vibe. Sup, homie? Check this out, this is pretty cool. <laughs> I love it. Next up is this creep show. Okay, that's like kind of legit scary. Black roses, a nice touch. This guy just playing the candle bongo. Creepy eyes on the fridge. And last but not least, <laughs> oh yeah, and I forgot to show you the best part of all of the decorations. And, ta-da! Hello, sir. Look at this silly guy just waving to the world. And it is a spider-filled mess out here. Me, shme, shme. Me, 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 me. Oh, by the way, that's an elementary school across the street. And so far, they love it. And PJ's stuck in the, oh no. You mongrel. Stuck in the webs again. It is that time. Time to break out last year's Halloween costumes. As you can see, we have a neatly marked box that clearly states the contents inside are Halloween related. It's a safe assumption, right? Let's pull everything out. Okay, we got Batman. Yeah, Iron Man. You like that? Is you're wearing one. Woo! Wonder Woman. Oh, and by the way, I got four new costumes that just came in from Amazon. Bingo! She's super excited. Penny is not. Let me show you. Hi, Magoo. Magoo does not like costumes, but this one does. Okay, like I said, I've got four brand new costumes. I'm gonna show you two of them, but two of them are a surprise. First, classic Lion's Mane, and it fits their color perfectly. The other one, as you saw, Little baby Yoda. I got a large, hopefully it fits. So we're gonna try on these and these, and then I'm gonna show you the surprise ones. All right, you guys ready? Yep. 
No way. Yep. <laughs> nope. Mixed feelings? No way. Yep, 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 no yep. way. Here comes the hard part. Try to get the costumes on. One volunteer. You're going to be Iron Man. There we go. No. We got ourselves an Iron Man. Come here, Tony Stark. Let's get Batman involved. I'm Batman. Oh, you will be. And she hates it. <laughs> Iron Man. Let's go beat Thanos, huh? This next one's pretty simple, and I think it suits Penny perfectly. Should be a lot easier than that last debacle. I'm going to attempt this one-handed. <laughs> Next up, Baby Yoda. All right. <laughs> Is that good? I don't know why Yoda decided to pick a fight with a lion. I thought Yoda was a pacifist. Okie doke. We got PJ in the dinosaur costume, except this time there's gonna be a little group participation. Give me one sec. This one is my absolute favorite. I have no question, no doubt in my mind that you will agree. Check it out. We've got Pennywise and Georgie. Hiya, Georgie. Would you like a balloon? I'm Pennywise, the dancing clown. <laughs> okay, that was some spooky, silly fun. But just as we were wrapping up, the fun came to an abrupt end. Are you guys Well, that's happening again. I was just gonna say how ridiculous you look, and you, and great, back to that. <sighs> well, we're almost done filming. I'm just gonna set up another camera just to see if anything happens. Okay, I'm gonna set this over here, facing there. And this, this, uh, we're, we're done. For now, this is going in there. Okay. What is it gonna end? 